I hope Fenrir got some sleep. Maybe he'll be ready to eat when we get home. He is quite sick, Trace. I know, but he was a little better yesterday. Until he wasn't. If he keeps eating, I'm not giving up on him. That easy. What she? She never does. Stay alert. Oh, 
River safe. We made it. Let us go home. It's Becky. Ivana. Up. <laughs> I'm sorry I couldn't take the shot. I did not wish you to. I keep hoping she'll let it go. You saved her life. I killed her son. There is no letting that go. Yeah. I guess killing Balder really did bring on Fimble Winter. Never stopped snowing after that day. Think it's ever gonna get better? Mm. Someday. But the worst is still ahead of us. We must be strong. Get the deer. Go on, girls. I don't hear him. He always says hello. Atreus. Fenrir! You okay, boy? to eat. Eat. Why? Too big? Near. You must prepare yourself. For what? He's still eating. He wants to live. He is dying. And strong, but you can rest now. 
Okay? I'll be okay. You can let go now. You have to let go. Sofna. Afra. Desu. Sofna. It's on. Sofna. the middle of the night. Night does not stop our enemies. Why? What for? Training is all we ever do. Ever. It's not enough. We can't hide forever. Time is running out. The prophecies say Fimblewinter leads to Ragnarok. War is coming. Whatever Loki's supposed to be doing, he's supposed to be doing it now. My story doesn't end hiding in these woods. I should be out there, finding out who I am, who Loki is. I will not allow you to pick a fight for gods. I don't want to fight anyone. I just want answers. And if those answers lead to war, Asgard. Maybe that's what Mother wants. I do not know what Mother wanted. Looks like you never will. moment alone with Fenrir before I bury him. Recognize that dour expression anywhere. Care to tell me what went wrong? The wolf is gone. Oh, no. Not Fenrir. How's the lad taking it? Not well. He goes to bury him. Right, brother. Good night, then.
Kratos? Are you joining me? Are you ready? You walk as though Emir himself sits atop your shoulders. This is your hunt. I will follow. Very well, Grimmels. Fresh kill. At least it didn't suffer. Hmm. to decipher your grunting? Tell me your thought. We hunt a predator. A wolf, yes. Predators kill. It is the natural order of things. Your words are misguided. Shh. Approach slowly. It's okay, little one. We want to help. Don't we? No, don't! Come on. The sick wolf we found beyond our stave. He found his way inside. As I said he would. We should have acted. It was not our concern. Now it is. The problem doesn't have to reach our doorstep for it to be our responsibility. If we have the power to limit the harm it could cause, we should act. Who are we to hide and do nothing? We are not hiding. Gonna make me pick that one up? Mm. Mm. Good boy. Atreus. Hence my bellowing. He never came back from Duddy and the Wolf. It's been some time. He cannot be far. Let's see. Tracks had... <laughs> ...down to the frozen river. That's most likely where he did the burying. He crawled through here. You seem troubled in your sleep. 
Even for you. Nightmares? I dream of the past. Almost every night. Ah, the bad old days in Greece? No. It feels like Faye is trying to tell me something. You don't mean to say you're talking to ghosts again, brother? No. But it is something more than memory. Hmm. Use your words, brother. The tracks stop here. And we're not alone. Check on the protection stage. There's a tree up ahead, yeah? Well? You were right. The stave is broken. Explains our trespassers. What happened here? A bear. Mauled. By what? A larger bear. Wounded. The fight destroyed the tree. We must find Atreus. Aye. Between the savage beasts and marauding raiders, he may have sought shelter. Follow the trail. We'll find him. Any idea what could have made the lad wander off? We argued. He accuses me of... hiding from Odin. Eh, only sensible to keep a low profile after killing three of his kin. A reckoning will come. That is why Atreus must learn to survive on his own. Oh, this is about that prophecy. Just because the giants had you dead on some wall full of otherwise accurate predictions... I do not believe in prophecies. Well, good. that trail gone. Atreus can handle himself. You've taught him well. So he keeps telling me. <laughs> Are these the raiders you rescued the walls from? No. They have not been here long. goes through here. Leads deeper in. There will be more. Atreus, are you here? Hmm. Huh. Well, that's for the best. Let's find a way out. Perhaps Atreus came here seeking shelter. He kept moving when he saw the raiders, and the bear came barreling after. Impressive rampage, I'll give it that. Hmm. Atreus, where are you? <laughs> <laughs> Well 
we found the bear. Or he found us. Atreus! 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 What? Just focus. Heal. What happened? You're not good enough. Fenrir, and then I'm not sure. I was so sad, and then I was angry and scared. I remember running. There was a bear. Charging and I charged back. That had to be a dream. Your emotions they transformed you. Uh, I, I I didn't know I could do that. You've already taught me discipline. I need more than that. I need answers. Answers you don't have. Answers only your mother had. That's what she withheld. What if there was someone who could help us? Someone that could give us answers about the giants and who Loki's supposed to be? Atreus. Wouldn't that help to understand what I'm becoming? Atreus! Listen to me. Serious. 
Inaction is also a risk. You taught me that. Stop thinking like a father for a moment and start thinking like a general. No! This way. So, are we going to discuss the boy becoming a bear? Yeah, are we? Not now. We need to repair the protection stave and get home. What happened to the protection stave? You did. So you're blaming me? I am not blaming you, Atreus. Well, tell your voice that. Say the word, brother. Now! Another raider! To the left! Besides your gift of language and hearing creatures' thoughts, are there any other new magical abilities to report? Not really. What of Fenrir? What about him? When he died, you cast a spell. No, I didn't. But I saw light. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, check your thimble, Winter. I recognize perhaps. where we are now. Seen my share. Of blood. Yours, Atreus. That or any prey you might have been dragging, I suppose. Not sure that makes me feel any better. This one. Does not matter. Uh, Only consequences. Uh, what? Uh, what can we do? Nothing. Nature will take its course. Storms are coming. Isn't it cold enough? We are almost home. those yeah. It's been like this all night. He must have been inside the stave when I fixed it.
Atreus! I'm just checking on... To bed! Yes, sir. As evenings go, that was entirely too eventful. Though I admit it was a bit like old times there, for a moment. The three of us navigating some hitherto unhappened-upon patch of forest. Been a while since you've joined us. If that's what you mean. Ah, well, just tired, I suppose. You've seen one deer hunt, you've seen them all. How can you feel tired when you never sleep? There are other kinds of tired, lad. You'll see when you're older. Now have a proper rest, my brother. Things are always brighter in the morning. Come in. I have meat. You would not find me good company. No. I'm sure we'll find lots to talk about. told me before I poured. Why are you here? Uh, just uh, being polite. You seem like a calm and reasonable person. See the moment calls for calm. <laughs> yeah.
know who I am. Back before winter set in, there were some misunderstandings. Regrettable ones. But I think we all have a better idea of who we're dealing with. Now, what you did to his boys. Okay. Self-defense. Dying is what we Aesir live for. And let's be honest, they were kind of useless. But Balder, he had value. He was my best tracker, my closer. Yeah, his mind was gone, sure. But he had his uses, and now he's gone because of you. You follow me? You have a debt. You're no fun anymore. What do you want? How about peace? How does peace strike the esteemed, retired god of war? How about we just don't kill each other? How about you stay home? Kick up your feet, seek no quarrel with me, and I'll have none with you. Of course, it means that that one, that one has to stop his search for tear. Yeah, we know what you've been up to. Stop it. Tear's old ways are dead. He is dead. You understand? And then that's it. Then we're square. Shit, I'll even sweeten the deal. I'll let you keep the prisoner that I know you stole. <laughs> That's right. I know you're in here somewhere, you silver-tongued little shit. Why should we believe a word of you? What of your promises ever been worth? There he is, my old partner in crime. He's lost weight. If he tells you snow is white, he's lying. What kind of wisdom is that? Can't the smartest head alive see past himself? See that we all want the same thing? All right. Here's a deal I know you can trust. I'll settle your debt with my ex. Keep Freya off your back. Keep your boy safe. It's really all you want, isn't it? So what do you say? Now 
Catch your breath, we're not through yet. If you're not fighting dirty, you're not fighting, right? Your son struck first! Good! You should be better than this! Ah! Oh. 
suns fell to you. Even this lesser version of you. But I am not my sons. And your boy, all father, had plans for him. <laughs> Consider your blood debt paid. Be seen. Told you he'd make it. Kratos, it's Sindri and Brock. That was quite a fight. And we. Oh, now. Odin is with Atreus. Oh no. I'll go get a gateway ready. Come on then. Ain't a long walk. Well, good to see you making new friends. Ain't that me old near pack of punch? You know we made that hammer, right? You have mentioned it. I know that. Wasn't ever sure you were listening. At least it was good to see the axe hold her own. All set. This'll get you home. Last thing there, Tiny. If you got Aesir at your door, then I reckon your protection stays busted. Once you chase Odin off, you got another place to lay your head tonight? And I don't mean that talky, though. I will not abandon my home. Oh, yeah? And what's to stop the all fucker from spying on you? Or Raven pecking your house to splinters while you're asleep in it? Nothing, that's why. You go get your boy, and I'll speak to a certain someone about putting you up at his place in a pinch. I was about to look for you. Are you hurt? Are you? What does he want? To uh, pay for the roof. And he invited me to Asgard. Did he? I couldn't hear once he went outside. I told him no, obviously. Good. Why were you searching for Tyr? If I told you I was looking for him, you would have said not to. So you hid the truth from me? I wanted to tell you. I really did, but now that you know, there's something you should see. No. Just trust me, you'll want to. You have broken my trust. Then let me regain it. Let me show you what I found. Besides, we haven't seen the last of Odin. Or Thor. And clearly they can just walk in and blast holes in our home whenever they want. There's only one way to get them off our back. I think I know how. Sir.
And keep the change, you bastard! Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwood. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. The door didn't say anything else while you were outside. Yeah. He said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore. That the giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. You think he knows all the giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? What happened here? So close to home. <laughs> Almost to the bridge. Oh, guess the bridge gave out. And then need another path to the temple. Why would you come out this way alone, lad? I had dreams calling me here. Dreams. Oh. What the hell, brother? What was that? Something strong and dangerous. Oh, yeah. Being all the way I'm going. Remember when I said there was someone who might help us get answers about the giants and Loki? You mean Tyr, the old god of war in these lands, who is dead. Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty I'm keen on quiet. seeing what... I hear Lord something. Well, I got a tongue from a dead rather thick, not Behind you! Look out! wasn't in the way last time I came. Like I was saying, here was an ally to the giant. So he'd be on our side if we find him. And if anyone might know who I'm supposed to be, it's him. If he's out there, we gotta find him. How can we not? Those are many ifs, Atreus. What do you know? You'll see soon. Imagine what the lads found, but he says he has evidence. We've come this far. Let's see it. Many dead here. We should keep Too late. Use your blade. Burn them. Another raider to the left. Oh, great. Set them aflame, or they'll just keep coming. Isn't it nice how Fimblewinter wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on you. <laughs> <laughs> you climb. On it. 
Ah, he has gotten rather good at that. Yet another great scene. I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one more. Oh no! Brother! Father! On your guard, brother. I think we found our predator. I just bloody cheers it. Thimble Winter Freya, the Raider Storm Odin barging in, and now Stalker's playing in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. Father, the shield Mom gave you. Thor damaged it, but now... Perhaps the dwarves could take a look at it. Perhaps. Later. Come on, we can get in this way. Why are we here, Atreus? Okay. You remember all those shrines we found, telling the stories of giants? How the panel on the left would be their origin, and the panel on the right would be their fate? Yes. We found many. I have seen them. Well, there's more to them than we realized. Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. That should help. There we go. Come on. Watching. Well, that's new. Come on, Atreus. Wait. Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. What is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories, the secret stories, those they kept here. Inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati? The wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? <clears throat> Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. Not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is, but someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then. The moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse? I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. 
Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mimir, can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait. I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No, I found it in one of the other shrines. Other shrines? How many have you visited? I. well. all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard, anyway. I don't know what it is, but it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned, but I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. He mentioned black smoke and the bleeding earth, but we can never figure out exactly. We. Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. it. It wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muspelheim? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding earth? Sounds like a mine, aye. The realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Svartalfheim, that's a good bet. Their minds did burst black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it then. Tears in Svartalfheim somewhere, imprisoned in a mine. So? What now? Even if we consider looking for Tyr, how do you have us getting to Svartalfheim? You know Odin's had all travel between the realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember you lost control. You must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. Are you okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first.
do? Almost home. Brother, a word. Don't hold the lad's curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. If we could find a way to open Rome travel to Sparta Farm, I bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us to... Enough. We will go. Really? But if we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search. For good. Over here! Sentry! As I live and breathe, is that Atreus? It's been so long. How you've grown! <laughs> uh, oh well, yeah. Mm. Well, if you'll follow me, Brock mentioned you needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. After you, my friends. Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Great. After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Until you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. As you can see, We've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimble Winter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay then, your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any, anybody need a snack? Kratos, snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparta Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's, what? It's okay, I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son and disobeyed me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... Something we needed your help with. Oh! The Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Not so bad. How'd that get in here? What the hell is it? That's my son. Well, what in all yarns be the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. He looks like that. I blame you. Now, well, come on, then. Let's get him something that fits, at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey. I yeah, suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivanting. Do you know this? Mmm. Busted up good. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? Hmm. Looks like Thimblewinner's been hard on our girl. Give her here. 
She's overdue for some Brock love. Some items you left behind, tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look around, check out my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready.